What's up guys, my name is Zero Heroes and welcome back to Kona. Now the reason that I'm starting here, long story short, basically, I recorded this, this is my second time recording it. The first time recording it, it was about 40 minutes and my audio didn't actually play. It was actually, my audio wasn't pushed to talk and none of it, you couldn't hear my voice at all, you could only hear the game volume. So that's basically 40 minutes of all the stuff that I did gone. Now I am going to show you what I did, I'm basically going to sum up what I did do, but it was very exciting and you did miss it. So you know how we're going to, uh, you know how I had to get the tracks, I I'll show you, don't worry. Um, you know how I had to get the tracks for the snowmobile and all that. Well, the tracks, I did go on the Steam community, I did a wee bit of research, and it was actually right beside the snowmobile. I will show you when we get back to the area. And also, to get the gas can to fill up, um, the keys were right here. The gas can, to get the gas can, you had to go to one of the houses, and this was one of the places you had to get the keys from this area here. And then, go into the shed, and then, go into the shed all the way over here. You know how we can open the shed? And I had to get the key. Well, the key was in there, uh, so we had to get. We had to unlock the door, which we did. And um, there is. There's a gas can. So we'll pick it up. Or, or, of course, our inventory's full. Um. So let's go back. Uh. Let's kind of just deposit stuff. Stuff that we don't need. Um. Don't need. Also, um. I did get a a gun. Um. Sorry, I did get some ammo for a gun. I got a rifle. And I'll show you where I got it. And um, don't worry, I will show you everything that that you missed, cause it is a wee bit unfair. I did get a Lee Enfield rifle, and I'll show you where I got it from. Don't worry. Um, uh, don't worry about a thing. I'm just gonna empty. There we go. I'm just gonna get this uh, this gas can. Now, if you do get guys, if you if you guys do like call to art, sorry, Connor, not call to arms. If you do like Connor and want more of it, then please let me know in the comments down below because all your support is very much appreciated as as always. So, uh, without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Now, let me open up the map and show you what I did in the first recording. So. As you said, as as I said, I started off down all the way in that road, kind of where the snowmobile is and the secret project. Now there is a cave called the Ice Cave that I did go to, and I'm gonna and I'm gonna go there and show you what exactly what I saw. Now because this was already saved, um, I don't think it's going to show you all the stuff that it showed me in the first recording, which it which is quite unfortunate, and I did and I had to delete it because. Um, uh, break and because um you know there was no audio so which was very unfortunate and I was and I was very sad uh, about it but uh, yeah we're heading in the right way so we're gonna go to this cave and I'm gonna show you what I saw and what oh Jesus Christ are you serious oh hold on there's stuff here there's stuff here there's stuff here I never saw this hold on I didn't see this in my second recording and sorry, in my first recording. Oh, a box. Come on, open up, open up, open up. Open up. You need to you need to open me up. How do I how do I get you? How do I how do I jump over you? How do I jump over you? How do I How do I Ah, there we go. And nice, just more stuff. Right, let's go back. That was it. That's all. That's all there was. All right, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Now, as I said, I am sorry, but I uh, don't worry. I will show you what I saw in my first recording because this cave I've never been to before. This is, I never went to this cave before, so I just want to make sure I am reaching the cave. Yep, I'm about to reach the cave. Ugh, crap, I can't see. I can't see. Yes, I know I'm a bad driver. Get over it, people. I am a bad driver. So it was 
let me see, nope, not here. Here, here it was, okay. So let me show you what I saw. So I don't know if it'll show me it again, because I, because this game has already been saved, but this was the cave over here. Now, like I said, if you, um, it was when I first saw it, I, I, some of the things I shit my pants, literally, I shit my pants, and it was very, quite scary, but I'm okay. I am okay after it. Um, oh, there's actually stuff over here. No, okay, nothing over here. Okay, nothing over here. This is called the Icy Cavern. Uh, but th this is what I saw. Now, I am going to need to take my flashlight, I think it is. Um, uh, land. No, not the gun. Not the gun. Damn it. Lantern. Here we go. It's just so you guys can see better. Now, like I said, it was... This is this is what you guys are going to see now. Um, oh, damn it. Is it blocked off? Are you serious? It's, it's covered in ice. I don't think I can show you. Hold on. Let's take out my camera. I don't think I can, I also I did find dynamite in here, hold on let me see if I can blow up with dynamite. I don't think I can. That's, oh no, I wonder if I can go in the other way, now there was, that's a real shame, don't worry I think I can still show you because there was another way that I could go um, to get into the cave. Um, and I can't remember where. Oh, I'm terrible with directions. I'm I'm really sorry. I'm quite bad with directions. It wasn't over here. It was actually, if I can remember correctly, um, I went into this area and there was ladders that I could go up and get inside. I just, oh, I can't remember where it was. I know it wasn't here. I know it wasn't, you know, above the cave. Um, so let us, let us go in this. Now, most of you probably want to see the snowmobile working, and and a hundred percent agree. But I really want to show you this cave, but I just can't remember how to get in it. Um, oh, I'm so annoyed. Um. I wonder if it was down there. Oh, I really can't remember. I'm so annoyed. Hold on. I'm sure it was here somewhere. I'm sure it was here. So I'm sure it was here somewhere. Like along this road. Or along, the along here somewhere. I know it was here. I know if I just keep walking. Um Yeah, it was it was straight on. Don't worry guys, I there was I'm definitely gonna show I'm definitely gonna show you this. Yeah. Huh? We're going out again. Okay. Where are you going? Alright, okay. Sorry about that, that was my sister. Don't worry, I'll edit it. You won't you won't hear it. Um No, it was back. You have to take me. No, come on. You have to take me. I know it was down here somewhere. Don't deny me. Damn it, I'm really annoyed that I can't show you guys. Because it was really... It was... I'm sure it was here somewhere. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Yes, finally I found it. 
Okay, I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys this cave. I'll show you guys this cave. Here we go. Yes, finally, we're in. Okay. So, I will explain to you what happened. This is basically the back entrance. So, what happened here, there's a frozen man and, of course, it won't show me again, which is unfortunate, but... It went, uh, you know how it, when you saw that first man back in the barn, this space, and I had kind of, I went into this kind of other dimension world or thing where everything was dark and then, you know, back in the barn. Well, this basically happened the same. This guy got attacked and it went all the way back here. He fell and of course he froze. But as you go further along, hold on, you probably can't see a thing. Wrong thing. Um, let me just get my lantern out. There we go. So I went further back here and the guy, there was footprints um, and I'll show you where it goes. And if you follow me, it leads, well, actually, it actually led to up here, um, which I, which I can't go. But if I show you, um, I went to up, hold on, let me just quickly show you. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Bye. No problem. Sorry, that was my sister's friends. So as you can see, it led to up here, and the vision was kept going, and he was like, he was like building stuff. And there, were, this is where I found the TNT, and this is where I found the gun. You know how, I brought, you know how I showed you the gun. Well, this was the gun. Um, so. And of course there was lots of stuff here and don't worry I did check everything and I'll let you guys see it as well It says why not sleep at home when you can sleep in a cave? Yeah, why not? So I know it's kind of hard to kind of explain and you probably rather see it But I'd have to, if I if you want to see it I would have to start the whole game again, and I really don't want to do that So yeah, so it says he seems to have made some modifications here yeah, so with the TNT and so Unfortunately, um, and if you look here, smuggled booze, and then the fire, and then that that was really it. And then I can't go, I can't go down here because of it's blocked, it's blocked, and I can't use the TNT. So that was the cave. And if I actually show, you, if I go the other way, and I and I'll show you guys that way as well. So, but you should have seen there when I when I first went into the cave. Um, there when I first went round this corner, there was a wolf. Now it wasn't any particular wolf; it was like a special wolf. So, and the wolf kind of backed off. So, and I and then I had to. And by the way, this bit wasn't here. This was like at the start when I first entered the cave, and this bridge wasn't built. So I had to go back, get my stuff, build the bridge. And then I had, and then I found the gun. And then as I went further along, you know, to where the ice man was, this wolf appeared, and he looked different from different wolves. Does that make sense? And once I killed him, he just popped into snow. He just died, and that's it. So, yeah, that was that was basically the whole story. But if you own the game and you haven't been to this area, go to the cave and see for yourself. It's like I said, I know it's weird that I explained it and it doesn't really make sense when I explain it. But if you play the game yourself and you have the game, go do it yourself. Because, and like I said, I am sorry for kind of not adding, uh, missing out the, um, m uh, you guys missing it. But it was just, for some reason, I, I completely forgot that my, that my audio was on push to talk instead of voice activation which was really annoying so i'm sorry about that but what i might do oh wait no i deleted it damn it i was gonna say i could add a wee bit of the cave at the start uh from my first uh clip from my first recording but i deleted it so i i can't recover it back but anyway let us carry on back to the you know the house where the snowmobile is and um, and I, and I did do some more researching on the snowmobile uh, of where to get the tracks and like I said I'll show you I'll show you where I got the tracks from um, so yeah let let us go there and what I'll do is uh, I will 
I'll edit this part out and then I'll see you guys in a couple of minutes where when we'll get to the house or the snowmobile so I will see you guys in two seconds so here we are I here we are so I've got the tracks on now but the tracks were right here right right here on like hanging on this bit on this piece of wood and I feel, feel really stupid and now we can go fill up the gas can uh, there we go, and I do have the I do have the sparks for the snowmobile and the keys. So uh, let's go plug that in. There we go, and now we can go drive it. So let's go. So like I said, I am really really sorry for for kind of for you guys missing out in the cave, and I and I feel really stupid and dumb, but um, it's just the way that it is. Now for the snowmobile. The mechanic was still frozen, and Carl had everything he needed, so he felt ready to leave. Yeah. So, now that we've got this bit, so let's have a look on the map. Now, if you remember, when we got, you know how we, if we got all the way back, and then we go up to kind of where kind of that pathway is, and you know how the main road is blocked? Well, what I'm thinking is we use the snowmobile to, um, to... To take use snowmobile along the path and head all the way up to the Hamilton House, or or the man or the man stand Nord or up that area. Um, so I'm wondering if we go up, if we use a snowmobile for kind of using the pathway. I'm wondering if we can do that. But what I'm thinking is I don't want to. I kind of want to take the car, but I was wondering if there was kind of like a hook or a chain where I can maybe attach the car to the snowmobile. But I don't think we can. So I think what we have to do is... Um, I think we're just going to have to use the snowmobile um, instead. Um, so yeah. Um, I Actually what I'm going to do is... I'm going to... Uh, withdraw. So I've got basically everything in here. Um, I don't really need anything... Um, but let me check my inventory because I want my gun. Do I have my gun? No, I don't think I do. Um, okay, my brain thing is good. My equipment. Okay, I have the gun. I have the gun. What I'm going to do is... What I'm going to do is actually I'm going to take the car first and then to go up to the uh, to go up to that place uh, all the way up there and I think the road is still blocked but I'm not a hundred percent sure oh crap I think I might need to move the snowmobile I wonder if we can attach it though I really want to know if we can like at attach the snowmobile to the to the thing you know what I don't think we need I don't think we need the car actually. I think if we just head I just think if we just head now well, we can do it. So, you know, what, let's go. We don't need the car. Let's go. Let us go to the um the area. Uh Oh, I can't even use the map. Okay. So, I'm actually going blind here. Okay, so I'm going to have to take a really estimated guess of where I'm going. Uh, I, I know roughly where I'm going. I don't worry. I've already checked out that area there. Um, that's just that. What that was there was just a bunch of logs, and that's it, <laughs> literally. So we are going to head all the way back, and then once we get there, we'll take the detoured route that I said we were going to take, and then we will uh, we will go, and then we'll go from there. So what I'll do is. Because this is quite a long journey, I'm not going to bore you with with me talking to you for the whole journey. What I'm going to do I'm going to edit this part here, and then I will see you guys when we get to the um, to the kind of the blocked road area. So I will see you guys in about two seconds, yeah, because you won't you won't even notice it. So I'll see you guys in two seconds. Okay, guys, um, welcome back. We're not exactly there. But what I did find, which I don't think we've been to yet, is this area here. 
Um, I don't really remember checking it out, so let us let us go in here because it's private and yeah, I don't actually remember this bit, so um, let us go. So let us go in here. The wood, the wood lots. We've we been here before. Have we been here before? When we f like at the very, very start. I think I'll take that hatchet. Okay, looks like I can't. Okay, my inventory's full. That's fine. Let's keep going. Let's see what's around here. Cause I said I, yeah, I've not checked out this area yet. Um, so let let's go. It was a typical shack, just like the ones you hear about in Quebecois legends. Local lumberjacks used it to rest and twice a day eat up their pea soup. Let's move piece. Let's play some chess. Let's get some light in here. There we go. They should have put a carpet here. Yes, they should have, but they didn't. So boohoo. Nothing's really in here. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. There's some light. Nothing's really in here. Just cards and chests and that's it. Wow, what a boring life. What's that red thing there? I don't know. Can we crouch? Okay, maybe not. Oh, there's something in there. Cigarettes. Can we climb up? Nope, okay. Well, there's nothing really in here. Let's keep, let's move on. Because there was nothing really here. Oh wait, there's a foot track here. Empty glass. Yeah, nothing really here. Right, let's move on to the next area. I hope this thing doesn't run out of gas, because um, I, I really hope it doesn't. Because we need to make it all the way to up to Hamilton's. Let's keep going. Now I'm sure I saw in the mini map that there was another, th another kind of house up here. So let's keep looking. Oh, oh, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What's this up here? Looks like another house. Have we been here before? I feel like we have. Feels like we've been up here before. This cabin doesn't look like a bunkhouse, especially with the missing stove and chimney. Carl was intrigued at the secrets possibly hidden here. Yeah. Let's keep looking. Just another one of these things. Let's just keep taking pictures of these. Oh! Hold on. There's footprints. Hold on. Hold on, there was footprints. I saw it in a picture. There's footprints leading up here somewhere. Throw away. There's foot. Oh wait, no, those are mine. Whoopsie. <laughs> I thought I thought there was intrigue. Nope. Let's keep going. Maybe up here. Maybe there's something up here we can find. A fireplace. A treasure map. Oh, so it's like a path. Looks like we need to follow this treasure map. Okay. So is there like somewhere we can go? Do we keep heading up? Do we head over here? Nope. Wait, what was that picture there? 
What was that picture? Treasure map. Okay, so apparently, if we follow kind of this area, apparently it'll lead us somewhere. If we follow up this area, it'll lead us to somewhere. I don't think it does, though. Oh, another, another ice wall. What is this? My god, we're finding out lots of things today. Another treasure map. So we're there. We need to keep following on that road. Oh. Huh. Let's keep going. Ah! Uh. Carl knew why he was suddenly shivering. He was going back to the realm of visions. What? Carl had no issue recognizing the spirit-like figures, but he couldn't figure out what they wanted from him. I know what the phantom, the... freed of reality's shackles, vanished in the forest. Earlier, Carl had witnessed a tragedy that befell it. Another phantom disappeared in the wilderness. Carl had seen what happened to it too. Wait, it just went through the wall. There's only two left. What the hell? I just went through the wall. There's only two left now. What do you people want? I'm leaving. I'm good, thanks. Carl sensed that the cold was beating a retreat, as if he was moving away from some kind of center of gravity. Yeah, let's not go there. All right, let's keep moving. Let's, what was that treasure map again? So, no, four. We need to look at this one here. So that's where we were. We need to kind of head to the to the marked area. So we need to kind of like keep going. Down this way. No. If we head straight on, we're just going to head back into the thing. The ice wall. I don't want to go near that ice wall thing. I want to keep going. No, 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 stop. No, get away, you know, I'm not the doing- The further Carl moved away from the ice block, the more his senses came back to him. I'm heading back to the, I'm heading back to where we were. Cause you know, just, this thing has just got weirder and weirder each time, man. Right, let's keep heading back, because um, I think we're done with this area. Even though that treasure map, that treasure leads to somewhere, I have no idea where. And you know, I just want to get to the Hamilton house at this point and meet Hamilton. Okay, we're heading in the right direction. Yeah. Okay, so apparently there's... Okay, I think what that treasure map was leading was leading to was probably the key to get into the shack but I honestly don't really care <laughs> I honestly don't really care about it at the moment so we'll just carry on we'll just head back the way we came And I think you could carry actually carry on this road. Like I said, I'm sure we've been here down here 
I'm sure we've been down here before, but I have no idea where, where this leads to. Looks like it leads to another house. This one here. You know, I think we've been here before. When it wasn't snowing, like previously. Someone had been playing with a crossbow here. A very dangerous game. A bolt could hit someone's tire. Or their eye. It could even kill someone if the aim was right. Mm hmm. Let's open the door. Without let's... a single window to brighten things up. The inside of the cabin was almost pitch black. Beware of close encounters of me and furniture. Let's let's get a flashlight because I can't see a thing again. Yeah, I know. First aid kit, I'll take that. Yeah, we've not been here before. Okay, I'm kind of glad I came. Solitaire. A card game only hermits can truly enjoy. Ah, there Carl we go. Depressed at the thought of playing this. A, a suitcase with clean clothes. Okay, now I okay, I can't see what's over here. Nothing in the bag. This toothbrush is still wet. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's better. Anything over here we can inspect? Nope. Take cigarettes, though. Is that it? Wow, that was a bit boring. Everything was set up for a well-deserved snack. It seemed like the place hadn't been empty for long, but without knowing exactly why, Carl had the feeling no one was coming back anytime soon. Yeah. Oh, well. Well, that was interesting. Not. Right, I think that was the last one. Uh, let's just check around the area just to see if there's anything. Although I probably don't think there is. Come on, get the thing. Damn it, I can't get the thing. Whatever, it's fine. I've got cigarettes anyway. Or fire starters. Oh, my inventory's full. Hold on. Footprints again. Footprints again. Leading to somewhere. Let's have a look where this goes. Don't worry, I won't go too far. I just want to see where this goes. And it just leads to... Oh, hold on. I found the wolves. Hold on. Get my gun. Get my gun. Get my gun. Just in case they attack. I'm not here to shoot. Oh, they're here to attack. Carl never thought he would be dancing with the wolves. Yeah, don't. Let's see what's here. Let's. Let's kind of. Just kind of bring my morrow up a wee bit. Where'd he go? Where'd this wolf go? You know what? He's probably gone. He's probably long gone. I'm not going to chase him. Can't really be bothered as well. So let's just keep going. I didn't actually have to shoot him. I could have just easily just shot the air and then just scared them away. 
I'm sorry for shooting. I didn't mean to kill him, okay? Man, what? It just gets weirder and weirder whatever these are. That was my footprints, don't worry. Right, let's head back to the snowmobile and then, you know what? We're definitely, we're definitely going to head up to the, um, to the area where we were previously, where we, you know, first almost had a collision with, uh, with the other car. So let's head over there. I'm kind of, I'm kind of glad I checked out this area because if I didn't, then I'd be, I'm just kind of one of those people where if I don't check it out, then it's kind of like a big mystery and I kind of want to go check it out. So I'm kind of glad I did. Even though there wasn't much there, there's, we still got one shed and a kind of a treasure chest and a treasure to kind of search, but let us keep going. Let us uh, head back and then I think we'll head up to our near Hamilton's house. So let's go. And you know, I'll see you guys, I'll edit this part out too, I'll see you guys in a minute where we, when we got to the part where we kind of crashed at the very start of the game, so I will see you guys in about, in a second, okay? Bye! Well, I'm not leaving, but, you know, see you in two seconds. Alright, here we are, ladies and gentlemen, the, I think the road is... The track was fresh. That meant the car sunk down just a little while ago. Now, where the hell could the passengers possibly have gone? Alright, okay, this is n not new to us at all. A lone boot and something else. The Let's crossbow bolts had the same origin. Carl was sure of it. Who was it? And more importantly, what was being hunted like this? Hmm. Let's there check. was only void where the road should be. Carl hated dead end. He felt trapped. It was as if the road had drowned in the lake. He would have to find help by another road. Someone must have dropped this in a hurry. But whoever did was heading into the woods. Carl's tracking instincts were quickly kicking in. All right, and this is what the and this is what the snowmobile's for. So let's go. Let's -a go. I'm hoping I can take this vehicle in. Yes, I can. Nice one. Okay, let's keep going. So if we stop, sorry, I forgot to say to you. So if we stop, uh, let's have a look at the map. And as you can see, our car is all the way over there. But you can you can see we're starting to start to head up to kind of down this area all the way up to Hamilton. So um, let's keep going on our on our journey. Let's go. The ice wall. Oh, are you serious? It's the ice wall again. We're at the ice wall again. What is this? Is there no way to get past it? Hmm. Hi. Can't do anything. Hmm. I actually don't know what to do. Okay, well let's head out of here because obviously we're doing something wrong. Numbness was giving way to awareness. The vision was wavering. So obviously, I'm thinking we probably have to go over it or down the other side. Okay, you know, I think taking this is probably a bad idea. Taking this bit is a very bad idea. And for some reason, I can't, like, do anything. 
So let's just head back. Leave the snowmobile. Leave the snow. Leave the snowmobile here. I can't say that word because it's very annoying. And I think that. I think this. Um, let me show you. I think. Oh, not that. I think the treasure map has to do. My god. It's not that. Come on, game. Don't make me mad. Why? Why? It's documents. Treasure maps. So this is four. So we obviously need to head somewhere. Oh, hold on. Heading north. Okay, so if we look at the map. Oh, for Christ's sake, come on. So if we look at the map, it's to do with it's it's like where the cabins are and where the shack is so it's obviously to do here i think this i think that's what the treasure map is saying let's not go near that that ice wall cuz we'll get whipped back into the thing again I think if we keep going this way so this is where we originally were and this is where we found the the kind of the treasure area and that's where the ice wall is so if we look at the map um damn it come on documents treasure map so that's obviously where the shack is. So we obviously need to head back. Because the ice wall's there and that's a road. Hmm. That's a road. I'm thinking we need to head back. I think we need to head I think we need to head up the ways. Is there no way we can head up? Come on. Oh, here we go. I'm kind of hacking a wee bit. No. Come on. I don't know how you get over there. This is so weird. Let me look at the documents again. Let me look at the treasure maps. Treasure map four. So where do we go? We obviously go along the road. I think we need to head near the road. I think we need to head near the road. And go past the shack. Or the cabin or wherever it is. So we obviously need to head here. It's in here. Okay. Okay, yeah, we need to kind of like keep going. So let's have a look at the... I'm sorry about this, guys, but I'm just not quite sure who... Some... So we need to head up, then down. Okay, so we've only got two maps. So I think we need to head near the road, up, up past the shack. Okay, that's what we need to do.
so we need to head near the road. Okay, we're at the road. Okay, so everything we need to kind of head this way towards the towards the cabin area, I guess. So we're going to get this done because obviously we need to. We obviously we need to do this. No, none of this really adds up. <laughs> to be honest with you guys, none of this adds up. None of none of this really does add up because I'm still really confused what we have to do. And, and if any of you guys have played this and know what to do with the treasure hunt, then please let me know because it, it's obviously just to find the key to the shed. It must be here then. I'm sorry that I have to keep kind of looking at the... Oh. Is it here then? Is it here? It must be. This must be it. This must be where it is. I'm sorry I have to keep looking at it, but... So it's not. So where is it? It's past cabin A, across the road, and like... Like, that isn't very precise. Apparently, it's like... If we keep kind of, like, heading this way... Maybe I need to follow the wolf's tracks. Maybe it'll lead me to somewhere. We'll get somewhere, don't worry ladies and gentlemen, we will get somewhere. We will get somewhere, don't worry. Don't worry your little heads, because we will get somewhere. Does the track just stop here? No, it keeps going. Oh, here we go. This must be the... More materials were needed to stir up the flames. Okay. Six matches. I need wood though, not matches. Okay. Do we keep walking then? I guess we do, because there's nothing else here. Let's keep walking, because the wolf's track seems to know where, where it's going, so... We, we almost made it. Where is this leading to? Obviously across the bridge. I'm sorry this is such a long episode guys, but I'm quite curious to see where this goes. Okay, straight on then. And look where it took us. Fucking great. Took us to absolutely nowhere. Great, isn't, this isn't X mark, this is not X mark the spot. Ah, <sighs> all that for nothing, man. Hold on, hold on, hold on, what's that? 
What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? You know what guys, I think I might end this episode here because I have freaking no idea how to freaking do this. Because, yeah, I just have no idea. Come on. There we go. Let's go to this thing over here. Hmm. Well, all that was for nothing, man. Apparently, it's... Apparently, it's like... Over here somewhere. It has to be over here somewhere, because... That's where it says, X mocks the spark. X... Uh, X... X mark the spot. It's obviously not near the general store. It's obviously somewhere around here. Which clearly doesn't make any sense. Yeah, it's like... I don't know where we're meant to go. Maybe I need to look this up on the internet again, do a wee bit of researching, because I honestly have no idea where I'm meant to go with this. Oh wait, hold on, hold on, what's this, what's this, what's this? Oh! Finally, here we go. X marks the spot. Number five. Okay, so X marks the spot. Apparently, it's near the general store. Okay, we can do this. Okay, I promise we'll end the episode after this. I know this has been a very long episode, and I appreciate everybody watching, but this is it. This is where we'll be able to get where we're going. So, apparently, it's near the general store. So, go this way this way so we found the fifth one hallelujah so it's just beyond the general store we can do this ladies and gentlemen this is, was going to take time anyway because and if anybody's still watching I love you Um, yeah if anybody's still watching I love you for it and I'm still going the wrong way Jesus Christ. Uh, just keep heading down this way. So apparently it's just past the fuel station. Like how about let's get to the fuel station. Sorry, the general store. My bad. Let's get to the general store. And then let's have a look at the treasure again. Because apparently it's quite near... It's near like the treasure area. But, and I know I'm probably going to die soon. I'm okay just now. Am I? I know it is going down but I'm getting near. Don't worry. I know. I'm sorry everyone. Oh crap. Run. Run. Run, 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 run. Ooh, I found another one. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Get out of here. Did I find it? Number six, are you serious? I found number five. I found number six, now number five, sorry, number six. So there's the fuel station, I think that is. If we go into the main road, past the main road, and then go in connection with, oh, come on. 
go to the fuel station and then I think we just need to get to the general store let's bring out the map again because we're always going to need this on us we just need to get to the general store and then Oh crap, Let, come on, go over, go over, come on. There we go. Where is the general store? All right, it's okay, it's over there. It's okay, I found it, I found it, it's fine. I found it, it's okay, people. We are getting there. We will find this X marks the spot, as they say. This is probably over an hour now, because I'm not exactly counting exactly how long this video is, but let's get inside the store and kind of heat up a wee bit, because I am certainly not doing myself any good by staying out here. Alright, okay, this is, okay, close the door, close the door, close the door. Okay. Let us get out of here. So let us have a look at the sixth one. We're doing well, ladies and gentlemen. Next one. Next one. Right, so apparently, if we go into the main road, cross the main road, Where do we go though? We're at the general store. Man, this is really hard. Are you sure it's out here? No, I'm not exactly sure. Man, this is hard. This is hard. Six is cross a road. Leading to like the ice wall, I think that is. Is that the ice wall? It must be. I wonder, hold on, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. I wonder if we can follow this blue track which is a frozen river. You know what, guys? I think I'm going to leave it here because I'm completely stuck. Well, I'm not stuck. I managed to find it, but I'm kind of getting confused and I'm getting more lost and I think I'm not actually gaining anything from this. Yeah, I'm, I'm really not actually gaining anything for this. But you know what? I'm going to go into the general store and end the episode here because it's been long enough and if I carry on any longer this video is going to be up to two hours so um, I think it's a good place to stop and what we'll do is we'll just take a picture, we'll just take a camera, sorry a picture of this and I think we'll leave it there for today's video so i like to thank you so much for watching and all your support guys and I will see you in the next video. Sorry I was meant to say is that make sure you subscribe, hit that like button, tell me if you want more and all that just jazz, all the cool stuff that the kids do nowadays but um, yeah i like to thank you so much for watching and all your support and I will see you in the next video. See you later and goodbye.